Okay, so for the for the next part, so the first part of the recording was actually we generated a random number. Second part, we are now going to ask the user to give an, us an input variable guess. So we are going to prompt the user, prompt the user, or you can make a form. Doesn't matter. You can take get element by ID, take input from a form. You know how to do that now. Prompt. I will borrow Rob's phrase. Take a guess. Okay. So we put that into guess. Now the thing is, how do we check whether it is a number? To first of all make it into a number, we parse it. We want a round number, so we are going to use parse int. Now it parses it and takes whatever number it can from the beginning. And if what parse int also does is if it does not find a number, it will throw into the variable is nan is not a number. Now we can have we have taken a guess. We can set our counter, we can set guess count to 1. Okay. So I'll put a comment here. That's the guess input. That's my random number. That's the guess count is now 1. Okay. This is my algorithm. So the whole plan. Algorithm. The plan. So let's see if it actually works. Let's see if it, if I if my prompt works. So take a guess. Cool. So I'm generating a random number. I'm taking a guess, and my guess counter is one. Now I want to make sure that the user actually gives me a number. So there are two types of loop. Okay, I'm going to use both types of, of loops in this code. Yeah. So understand the first type of loop. The first type of loop is you will do something. You will do something while a particular condition is true. See whatever is inside the brackets. It, whatever comes inside an if bracket, we want that condition to be evaluated to true. So we are going to do something while a particular condition is true. What is it that we are going to do? We are going to keep prompting the user while is nan guess. So if the guess is not a number, if the guess is not a number or while the guess is not a number, or this can be read as as long as the guess is not a number, we shall keep doing this. As long as guess is not a number, we'll keep doing this. We are looping this. So let's see if this actually works. So now when I loop and I say take a guess, as long as I keep giving it garbage, it keeps coming back. As long as guess is not a number. And the moment guess is a number, so my loop is working. So the first loop is working and uh, what I'll do is I'll pause here. This, this will be a very short video. I'll pause here and we'll do the third part. So we have come we have come up to here. We have generated a random number. We have asked the user to guess a number, set the counter to 1 and we are checking if it's a number. So we have done about the three steps. I'll pause this video, give uh, Terence a chance to catch up, Aiden a chance to catch up.